testing. Check one, two. Yeah. Come on. Hey, sweet girl. Okay, this is Zoe. Say something. It is Halloween 2024. We are here for a spooky taste testing. And I'm so excited. <laughs> We're gonna get the first item. It came from a bakery I had no idea existed. Alaya's, I think. And we'll start easy. This is a cannoli. Nice! Yeah! Okay, so this is uh, just a cannoli. I love cannolis. I usually get them at Corner Market. Right. Cut it or fork it? Cut. Pick it up and eat it. Is it time to taste? Let me show. Very tasty. Good cream. I got a cannoli recently. I forgot to tell you that it had, or maybe I did tell you, it had like a citrus taste to the cream and it was gross. Okay, it is cannoli. Good. Cannoli bowly. <laughs> I'm starting strong. That's a 10 out of, 10 out of a 10. Because mm. I love cannolis anyways, but that one is really good. I like the powdered sugar on top too. I've probably had maybe five cannolis in my lifetime. Seriously, because I'm just not a huge sweet eater, but this cannoli is fantastic. I would say, I don't know, eight out of 10. Yeah. All right, we're gonna get the next item, which is gonna be baklava. Whoa! <laughs> baklava just appeared. I don't know where this dessert comes from. So my question is, what? It's got a little, I don't know. The baklava is pistachio, and then it's got like a super soft, really thin wafer bread kind of <laughs> stuff. I have no idea, but love baklava always. It's probably easier to buy them too. You might want a cannoli it. Real. Makes me want a cup of coffee. So mm -hmm. good. I think that the one from Corner Market is better. One hundred percent. Ooh, mm -hmm. crunch off of that. What do you give it? Um, probably seven. Solid seven. Six. Six. Was the number I had in mind. Okay, now the fun stuff. Okay. It's getting spooky. Spookier. Spookier. So what are we having next? A Zoe here. <laughs> and break. So this is, I don't know what. I don't remember you flavoring. picking this one. Did they just throw this I one in it, there for I free? It, no. It's like a toaster strudel. Not a Danish. I don't know. But I really wanted to try some things from a different country. I wish there was more filling on too. the inside. That's what she said. <laughs> For sure. Mm. That's like fig, I think. Mm-hmm. Dang. I gotta get another bite of that. I would give this one a 10 out of 10. Really? Yes, I would, because... I could totally eat that in the morning and have some coffee with it. I would give it like a solid seven. So, all right, let's keep going. So this looks like a Rice Krispie Treat <laughs> sandwich on steroids. This is ASMR or food tasting. <laughs> both, this must be both. Is it as heavy as it looks? I don't know. How heavy does it look? It looks pretty heavy. Can I feel the weight of that? It really feels like a cracker. Just kidding. I said, whatever it is, I'm getting one of them. You try it first. Okay. Fine with me. Oops. Got it right on my nose. Let's see what's on the inside. Is it completely... Is that marshmallow? Yeah. So it is, again, kind of the same style of like bread as like the baklava and the thing we just had even really is this is the um, cannoli the cream is like super thin and airy this one's mm. very light and flaky 
That is banging. 8.5 for me. I would at least say 9 out of 10. Mm. It's kind of like a Twinkie cream. Good combo. Textures and stuff. Yeah. So, I'm excited for this one. So, it's cheesecake. Ooh. But it looks good. That smells rich. It's a brownie cheesecake. The other option was red velvet. Dig in. Oh my goodness, I think this is too big of a bite. Okay. That is really good. And I am a weird cheesecake person. It's like so like, fluffy. Yes. Mm. How could you give it anything less? This that is been, so good. I would say definitely if I wasn't so full. A 10 out of 10. Because I know that I would eat more than one bite of that for sure. It just has a lot going on and I'm more simple. It just is, it has, it's, it's a lot. I need it to be a little smaller. 8 out of 10. Okay. Nice. Yeah. All right. We did it. Happy Halloween. I was like, please tell me that recorded. It was on the screensaver, so I was like, no! Could you imagine? Like, we already ate. All right. I don't care. It's so good anyways. I'm telling you, I'm, I was being dead serious when I said, had I not been so dang full. Mm -hmm. If we have eaten that first, I would have taken two bites. Well, I would hope you wouldn't lie to our viewers. I hate which this. Which is us. That was on your shirt. I didn't want to keep brushing you off every time.